So a lot of people ask, how can you opt out of your smart meter? Well, one way is to get an analog meter put back on your house. This is the original meter that was on the side of your home before the so-called smart meters. The analog meters are old school. They don't emit uh, radiation or any harmful frequencies. And this is exactly what one looks like. So if you notice here, this is the analog meter. It doesn't have the digital uh, display here and this is not like pinging to anything and um, it doesn't have Wi-Fi connected to it basically. If you uh, want to get one of these back on your home you have to pay an additional fee. Though I have had some people tell me that switching back to this your power bill goes down. So maybe that additional fee and the reduction in your power bill will offset but this is what one looks like. Kind of rare to see these you're really only going to see them in small towns that have not upgraded to the new smart meters yet and in other words uh, there's no harmful frequencies emitting from this thing and there's none emitting back into the house so if this was on the other side of someone's bedroom and you slept along this wall it's not what you want especially if this was a, a new and improved smart meter so essentially what they're doing here is they're making you pay to play. You know, you want to have it the old way, the way that you used to have it. Well, then you have to pay extra money and they'll claim it's because they still have to physically send a guy out and check your meter instead of just checking it online electronically. Um, but still, you know, that should be your choice. It's your home. Uh, the worst thing about those smart meters is most people got them put on without their knowledge. You know, the power company decided one day, this is what we're upgrading to. Um, and they just started putting them on people's homes, you know? It's one thing if there was no risk, but there is a threat to health and privacy with these smart meters. Not only is this something else that can be hacked into and controlled by, you know, the government or hackers, but this is emitting frequencies that, that we can measure. And you don't want to be sleeping or spending uh, long periods of time in close proximity to any of these smart meters. So just would have been nice to know if people had, you know, some informed consent on this topic too.